Once upon a time, in a small village nestled between rolling hills and lush forests, there lived a beautiful girl named Rapunzel. Rapunzel had long, flowing hair as golden as the sun, which she never cut because her mother had told her it was magical. Rapunzel lived in a tall tower at the edge of the village. Her tower had no doors or stairs, only a small window at the very top. Her only companion was a mischievous bluebird named Benny, who would visit her every day. One sunny morning, as Rapunzel gazed out of her window, she noticed something unusual. A tiny green shoot had sprouted from the window sill and was growing rapidly. It soon grew into a vibrant, twisting vine covered in colorful flowers. Rapunzel was amazed and decided to climb down the vine to see where it led. With Benny's help, she carefully descended the vine and found herself in a magical garden unlike anything she had ever seen. Enchanted creatures flitted about, and the flowers seemed to dance to a sweet melody carried by the breeze. Rapunzel explored the garden, discovering talking animals and whimsical beings. She met a wise old owl who shared stories of the world beyond her tower and a friendly squirrel who taught her to do somersaults in the soft grass. As Rapunzel roamed deeper into the garden, she stumbled upon a sparkling pool of water. At the water's edge, she spotted a curious fish with a shimmering tail. The fish introduced herself as Fiona and told Rapunzel about a hidden cave behind a waterfall that held the secrets of the garden's magic. Rapunzel and Benny followed Fiona's directions and discovered the cave behind the waterfall. Inside, they found a glowing crystal that radiated with warmth and light. Rapunzel reached out to touch it, and suddenly, she felt a surge of energy and magic coursing through her. With newfound confidence, Rapunzel and Benny returned to the village, where they used the magic of the garden to help their friends and neighbors. They healed sick animals, made the crops grow taller, and brought laughter and happiness to everyone they met. Over time, Rapunzel's magical garden became a place of wonder and joy for the entire village. And although she still lived in her tower, Rapunzel knew she was never truly alone. With the help of her magical hair, the enchanted garden, and her loyal friend Benny, she had discovered a world of adventure and kindness right at her doorstep. And so, Rapunzel's life in her tower was no longer lonely, for her heart was full of love and wonder, and her magical garden was a source of endless joy for her and her village. Reminding them all that even the most extraordinary adventures can begin with the smallest and most unexpected of surprises.